its way. Okay. So as you can see, the iPad doesn't work outdoors. <laughs> the iPad geeks will... You have not friends at Apple. <laughs> will not, will not uh, have, uh, what's it called, uh, they will not have uh, sun. They will not be able to go out in the park and enjoy. Uh, it's not a problem, but they not just have to buy the next version of the iPad, hopefully, with the Pixel Chi. There you have it. This is a wide view Pixel Chi. Yeah. Playing all kinds of videos. Maximum brightness. Oh, brightness. Maximum brightness of the iPad. Uh, right here, next <laughs> to the Pixel Chi. Yeah. It's hard to see it. I think uh, iPad should use <laughs> Pixel G. That's uh, that's what I was, uh, was kind of hoping uh, that uh, they would announce uh, world world's first uh, distribution of the Pixel G screen. They say they have wide view, but we do too. <laughs> so you need to adjust the angle, right? Well, this is wide view. We fixed the, the viewing angle issue. Yeah. We um, sorry, I'm just turning off the wireless networks. To test. So this is wide view. Mm -hmm. So you can see it upside down. Here is the iPhone. So iPhone has a different kind of screen than the iPad. Yeah. It's slightly, slightly more visible, but still a huge difference. It'd be nice to have an iPhone like this, where you have an outdoor... Will there be a 3.5 inch or 4 inch or 5 inch or all that? We're working on a bunch of different sizes right now as we're scaling up our manufacturing. So there's some demand in the 3, 4 inch and some demand in the 7, 8 inch. Also, nice. mainstream laptop sizes, so we're deciding which to do based on people like like the one holding the iPhone here. Right. <laughs>